Hello students, welcome to Vyas Edification Quota. In this series of NCERT discussion, we are on NCERT class 12th and in mathematics, the chapter that we are dealing with today is matrices. Matrices chapter we have started and we have discussed exercise 3.1, 3.2. Now we are moving to exercise 3.3 and uh, let's discuss the first question after this. What does the question say? Find the transpose of each of the following matrices. Okay, person is talking about transpose. What do you mean by transpose? Transpose of a matrix implies that you form a new matrix by interchanging the rows and columns. What does that mean? If let us say you have a matrix A, A, B, C, D, E, F. So this here is the first row, this here is the first column, first second row, this here is the first column, second column and third column, right? The rows and columns are interchanged and what you get after that is the transpose of this matrix which is represented by A prime. This is A transpose or it may be represented by this symbol. A and in the superscript you have a T or in the superscript you have a prime over there, A prime or A T in this manner right this is a transpose which is which is obtained by interchanging the rows and columns right the first column becomes the first row this ad becomes the first row over here the second column becomes the third oh, sorry second column becomes the second row the third column becomes the third row and correspondingly what has happened is this row this first row has become the first column the second row has become the second column as you can clearly observe over here the order the order also changes this was a 2 by 3 matrix this is a 3 by 2 matrix the number of rows and number of columns get interchanged as you can see very well that we are interchanging the rows and columns and yes that is how we get the transpose of any matrix that's the idea behind the transpose that's how we define the transpose of a matrix Right. Once you are through with this definition, can we find the transpose of this matrix? Yes, we can do that very easily. Let's try to find the transpose of this matrix over here. This is a matrix. Let A equals 5, 1 by 2, minus 1. This is a matrix A. Then, then transpose of this matrix. Then transpose of this matrix A prime would be equal to what? This A prime would be actually, this is a 3 by 1 matrix, this would be a 1 by 3 matrix, okay. The first column becomes the first row, this is 5, 1 by 2, minus 1 and this is my transpose of that given matrix as you can clearly observe over here. Is that all? Yes, that is all for this question. Let us talk about this one. We have another matrix and we are supposed to find the transpose of this matrix. Let, let B is this matrix. Let this matrix be named B. Then B transpose is equal to what? B transpose is simply replace the first row by the first column. This first row becomes the first column. The second row becomes the second column this is what I get and that's the transpose of this given matrix that is all yes let's talk about this part next third part for this question we are once again finding the transpose of the matrix how do we go about finding this let C let matrix C this matrix is called C let this matrix be called C this is minus 1 5 6 this is root 3 5 6 this is 2 3 minus 1 then c transpose c transpose is obtained by interchanging the rows and columns the first row becomes the first column the second row becomes the second column the third row becomes the third column and this is my answer for this question over here 